space exploration timeline. In 1900s, Konstantin Cholskovsky, a Russian scientist, showed that space travel was possible only by means of rocket propulsion. He began testing rockets in first decade of 20th century. Next is 1914, Robert Godward, an American professor who is credited with creating and building the world's first liquid-fueled rocket which he successfully launched on March 16, 1926. In 1926, this is also a picture of Robert Godward about to launch his first successful rocket. It was launched on March 16, 1926. In 1930, V-2 spacecraft, a ballistic missile that was developed at the beginning of the Second World War in Germany, the rocket was world's first long-range combat ballistic missile and the first rocket ever to go into the, fring the fringers frames of space. In 1914, V2 spacecraft was first successfully launched on October 3, 1942 and was fired against Faris on September 6, 1944. The V2 spacecraft was developed in Germany through the efforts of scientists led by Werner von Braun. In 1954, this is a picture of the Viking spacecraft. In 1954, the U.S. Air Force began development of Thor Delta's predecessors and 1955. The spacecraft reached Mars on September 23, 1999. Low Earth popular orbit, approximately 420 nautical miles above Earth. In 1957, history changed on October 4, 1957. When the Soviet Union successfully launched Sputnik, the world's first artificial satellite, was about the size of a beach ball. This launch is ushered in new political, military technology, and scientific developments. In 1961, Yuri Gagarin, hero of the Soviet Union, was Soviet cosmonaut who on April 12, 1961, became the first human to journey into outer space. In 1961, the, Reds, the Redstone rocket launched the first American satellite developed into orbit. The rocket was developed by a team headed by Dr. Werner, Werner von Braun, who had been working for the U.S. Army at Fort Bliss, Texas. A redstone rocket also launched the Mercury capsules on their suborbital flights on October 27, 1961, inaugurating American's human spaceflight program. In 1967, this is a picture of. In 1967, this is a picture of the lunar orbiter. The lunar orbiter was a series of five unmanned. Lunar Orbiter missions launched by the United States from 1966 through 1967, intended to help select Apollo landing sites by mapping the moon's surface. The, photog the photograph taken on 11, May 11, 1967. In 1969, this is the picture of Neil Armstrong in the first man on the moon. Apollo 11 was the space flight that landed the first humans on Earth in the moon. On July 20, 1969, the mission carried out by the United States is considered a major accomplishment in the history of exploration and represented a victory for the United States in the Cold War space with a Soviet Union. In 1971, this is the Mariner 9. Mariner 9 was the first spacecraft to orbit another planet. It launched on May 30, 1971, by NASA of the United States. In 1971, also, the Soyuz, the Salyut, was the first space station of any kind launched by the USSR on April 19, 1971. In 1972, this is, this is Apollo 16 on the moon. Apollo 16 was the tenth manned mission in the Apollo program. It was the fifth mission on to the land on the moon and the first to land on Highlands area. The mission was launched on April 16, 1972 and concluded on April 27. 
1973. This is the Skylab Space Station. Skylab America's first space station was two-level workshop in a converted Saturn as for B stage Skylab launch May 14, 1973. The Skylab Space Station orbited Earth for more than seven, 1,000 717 days. In 1976, this is the Viking 1 on Mars. Viking 1 was the first of two spacecraft sent to Mars as part of the NASA's Viking program. It was the first spacecraft to successfully land on Mar Mars and perform its mission. Landing on Mars was planned for July 4, 1976, but imag imaging of the primary landing site showed it was rough for a safe landing. It landed on July 20, 1976. 1979. This is the sense corona taken by the Skylab on January 1, 1979 by the U.S. In 1981, the U.S. space first launch on April 12, 1981 was the world's first reusable spacecraft. The space shuttle was initially used to deploy satellites in orbit to carry scientific experiments such as space love. In 1983, this is the Challenger taking photos of Earth that shows Australia. It was launched on April 4, 18, 1983 rather, by the United States. In a 1986, this is the Miss this is the Mir Space Station. It is launched on February 20, 1986. The Proton Booster launched the core module of the Mir Space Station. To the, soft, the official Soviet news reports, released immediately after the launch, said that the spacecraft is equipped with six docking ports and will serve as core of the future multimodular orbital station. In 1990, the Humble Telescope is a space telescope that was carried into orbit by a space shuttle in 1990, when he finally launched on April 24, 1990. Scientists found that the main mirror had been ground incorrectly, severely comprom compromising the telescope's capabilities. In 1995, this is Galileo's spacecraft he, can, he sent to Jupiter. Galileo was an unmanned spacecraft sent by NASA to study the planet Jupiter and its moons. And its moons. It arrived at Jupiter on December 7, 1997. It was discovered that Jupiter's faint ring system is formed by dust from impacts on the four small inner moons. In 1996, this is the Mars. Pathfinder is an American spacecraft that landed the first roving probe deployed on another planet. The mission carried a series of scientific instruments to analyze the Martian atmosphere, climate, and the composition of its rocks and soil. It was landed. It was launched on December 4, December 4, 1996, by NASA aboard a Delta II. In 1998, this is the International Space Station. The ISS is by, the, is by far the largest artificial satellite that was ever orbited Earth. The ISS is a synthesis of several space station projects that include the American Freedom to Soviet Russian Mir-2. The first module of the station, Sarya, was launched in Russia on June 3, 1998. So that will be all. Thank you for listening.